Alright, so hey guys, what is up? It's Game of Oz 2180 coming at you with a new video. And match. this video is actually going to be the HBR, uh, the HBR A3 video. And, and, uh, this, these are just highlights. Once again, hold on, I gotta uh, adjust my chair. Alright, let's go. Mm, gosh darn it, hold on. There we go. Well, almost perfect. Hostiles in the lobby! Yeah, see, this is, this is just HBR, uh, HBR A3, I'm sorry, I get the name kind of, you know, messed up sometimes, but yeah, see, um, my friends have actually been, uh, you know, requesting me to do this video because, you know, I, like, some of my friends are, uh, my subscribers, and, um, so yeah, and they were, they were just saying how, like, the HBR A3 is, you know, like a really good gun, and they wanted me to use it, so... I'm just like, well, okay, <laughs> I guess I'll make a video about it, so, um, yeah, that's that, and, um, oh, oh, snipers, oh, wait, no, that was, um, oh, wait, no, that was Link's Twist, I have the same thing, no, it's like a 13 twist, but, um, so anyway, um, I'm not doing too good, I'm actually losing by a bot, but once again, I am having some internet problems, so. Just like, okay, look, honestly, I will admit it, I am not too good at these guns, but I will try and do my best with these guns that I'm using now, just because, just for you guys, and, um, just because, you know, you guys don't want it and stuff, and, um, yeah. The HBR uh, A3 is actually a really good gun. I've gotten one cam on it so far, but um, yeah. Other than that, then um, it's still a good gun. It's still a good gun. I like it. it. It's actually a pretty good gun. But like, pretty much out of like this whole series, I'd probably I uh, you know, actually, I will tell you that when the series is done, like when the se when this series is finished with and then yeah and I'll tell you what my favorite gun throughout this whole series is so let's now let's just find some oh got both of them go. oh crap I was trying to go for that triple can we get that in you know time to oh wow I just took the lead by a whole lot but, Like, yeah, but, like, uh, you know, like, yet again, I am not, so, like, if you guys are, like, wondering, hey, why do you suck at this game, or, like, why do you suck, um, at, like, why aren't you, like, doing, like, good, then the question, like, the, your answer is actually gonna be, is because I will admit, once again, that I am not too good with this gun, so, I will just say it, but, I mean, I'm just doing it for you guys, so, if you guys want me to do some gameplay on this gun, then I'll do some gameplay on this gun. Just do it for my fans, you know? I don't do it for me, but, like, it's the same. If I were to do it for me, then I would have, like, you know, obviously my own classes. So, and, um, yeah. I would be probably beasting by now. But, I mean, not not saying that, like, you know, this gun is bad or anything. But, I mean, like, I'm just saying, like, look, like just like me, honestly, in my opinion. Not like for me, in my opinion, I don't use this gun, you know, like a lot. But I did use this gun once, and um, it was actually when my friend, I'm pretty sure he was the one who got me this uh, camo. So yeah, um, well yeah, yeah, like yeah, I'm pretty sure he was the one who got me this uh, camo. So um, and yeah, that's and I'm just doing this because he was one of. Uh, the people that actually inspired me to do this video. Oh, what? Oh, he came from behind. Whatever. So, uh, yeah. And, um, yeah, I don't really know what to say right now. But, oh, crap. 
Alright, well, um, let's go over here and get some kills. There we go. Okay, see now, another reason why I don't really like this gun is just because of the damage of it, but this gun is really good. <laughs> wow, I'm doing highlights on it and I'm just talking crap about it. Wow. I don't even know what I'm saying. But, <laughs> whatever. But, this gun is, is actually really good, but I would, like, highly recommend it for close quarter combat. Like, if I were to, like, if I were, like, like, say for example, like, if someone were to give me this game and say that I can only use this gun for, like, the, like, for, like, the rest of my career, ever, in this game, like, just, like, ever, then I would choose, like, something like this, like, close quarter combat, like, uh, TDM, like, which I am doing right now, so, yeah, like, I mean, that's what I would, that's what, uh, I would choose because TDM is actually, you know, like really good for close quarters. So right now I'm doing 29 and 13. Still, uh, pretty, still pretty good. Okay, oh yeah, and plus, like, and I really love this gun in campaign. This gun in campaign is just OP. So yeah, like, like if, and if you guys are wondering, why do I have, like, all these attachments on it and stuff like that? Well, like, oh okay, so first of all, I have the, the, um, um, like, I meant, wait, I screwed up on that last sentence, but, like, I meant, like, if you guys are, like, you guys just heard me, like, talking, like, bad about it, and stuff, like, I wasn't good with it and stuff, but, um, first of all, I, I just have these, um, um, like, like I have the target enhancer for it is because in campaign you uh, start off well like you have the target enhancer in the mission called crash so and in that mission you um use this gun which is the HBRA 3 which I'm using right now with the target enhancer and the foregrip so that's why I use this gun because this class is just amazing yeah, well, yeah, especially in the campaign, so, and plus, that's, like, pretty much another reason why I kind of wanted to do this video is because, you know, um, my friends, um, because at first I, I was like, um, the HBR3, what the heck kind of gun is that, or something like that, and then my friends are like, um, you know, that one gun in the machine of Crash, so, um, yeah, I'm like, uh, Crash, oh, that gun, and then, yeah, then I finally, uh, you know, recognized it, so, um, that's another thing which inspired me to do this gun, but, and also, like, my favorite thing I love about, like, this gun is also, is that this range is pretty decent, but, like, all you, like, I would, the only upgrades I would do to it is just higher the damage by just, like, a couple, you know, like, one or two, you know, yeah, it's just by, like, one or two, not, like, by, like, a whole lot, but, because, no, because it kind of takes a while to kill people on this thing, like, see, as you can see there. Kind of took me a while to kill him, but whatever. But it's it's still cool. It's still cool. So hmm. there we go. Straff that. Look down. I don't know where he went. It's probably gonna be like come up here soon. Crap, crap, get me out of here. Worst position. Oh crap, I was trying to shoot the other guy, but then I just got cornered, so I, I was just like, you know, I'm done. So. But yeah, like as I was saying, close quarter combat stuff, you know, like a uh, search and destroy. And uh, TDM. That those are like the two game modes that I would recommend this gun for, because this game, this gun is just um really good and um, like well, I mean like good for close quarter. I mean not like, but in the end, I did say that the I will admit the I did say that the range is good. See, as you can see on that last nice kill right there, Sentinel. um the range is pretty good, but I would but still like for range uh you know just in case. But see, it actually does take a while kill um people for this gun but i mean it's still a good gun but i would still recommend it you know for close quarter combat so uh thanks guys for watching and uh stay tuned for uh, more highlights and see ya